I didn't really engage very well in school. I underachieved and I just didn't apply myself. By joining the Air Training Corps, I found I had a need in life and I engaged really well. I achieved a lot and I really enjoyed it, the discipline and the sense of purpose that it gave me. I was fortunate that the officer commanding there gave a lot of time and dedication to me and inspired me to uh, improve myself and better myself. I joined the Royal Air Force after leaving the Air Cadets in 1990 and served for 10 years. I rejoined the Air Cadets in 2018 following a chance meeting with the Wing Padre and local councillor down in Pembroke. They were looking at uh, reopening the squadron at Pembroke, which had closed recently, and there was concerns it was never going to open. I decided to go back into uniform in honour of my officer commanding that had given me his time and dedication, and I felt I owed it to the youngsters of that area to be able to pass on my experience as well. As a member of staff, I've had some great uh, experiences. One that stands out for me uh, was a female cadet of mine that uh, was absolutely petrified of flying. We took her to the local air experience flight at Southern. She sat in the plane and the pilot took off and did a couple of circuits. And when he landed, the site that I was greeted with was one female cadet that was absolutely ecstatic and smiling from ear to ear. This for me is a, probably the greatest moment I had as a member of staff because it just showed the ethos of what the Air Cadets does. We always have difficulty in trying things that are new, but she went and overcame her fears that day. And it was just a phenomenal day for all of us. She's now progressed on from the flying syllabus and has gained her bronze badge, a silver badge, and she's also even gained her silver gliding wings. So that is a testament of the activities that we do in the Air Cadets and the ethos of the Corps. She's just one of our major success stories. And uh, if, you know, if I've helped one person in my time, then uh, that's a job well done in my books.